All right, so granted, I'm just idiotic, stupid dog. But you know what? I see this stuff like these dogs that walk up to each other. Two dogs walk up to each other. They stick their nose right in each other's asses. You know, that's a smell you hello kind of thing. I can tell where you've been. I know a few things we were up to just by sniffing your ass deeply. That's disgusting. But even though that is normal to me, what the skanks do is off-putting. This Wendy or Whitney Cummings, the next coming of Martha Stewart, you might sh- is she she likes to hang out with the skanks the way Martha Stewart likes to hang out with Snoot Dog. It's uh, it's one of those funny things that they're just like soulmates. But Wendy Cummings, she's supposed to be this you know a, a, lib- a liberal elitist, whatever. I don't know. I don't even want you. Know, but she's known for being a softy. Or something, you know, she's not going to be whatever you would say, real competitive or, you know, she doesn't believe in laissez-faire, you know, survival of the fittest. She's more like everybody needs to be helped. A little. She's more like along the lines of what Jesus said. And I'm just a dumb dog, so maybe I'm wrong. It doesn't matter. But during the skank fest, they brought the guy up who won the golden ticket. And for some reason, the skank star asked him, what does it mean to you to win the gold ticket? And was it worth it to win the golden ticket to have to admit to everybody and show everybody you have almost a non-penis? And he said it was. So I had to Google. It was very hard with my apparatchik. I was very difficult. I had to Google, what do you get if you get a golden ticket? It's like you, you don't have to, you get to go the head of the line at all their events. I'm like, wow. You know, sometimes they see like 29 people at these events. Would go to the head of the line. That was worth it. He gets, gets all day, passes to the skank fest. It's like sheepers, creepers, you know. I don't know, whatever. But they're up there on the stage, and they start seeing if they can see his penis, look at his penis, touch his penis. And this poor Whitney Cummings, I don't know if she became like it's like the Stockholm Syndrome. She starts touching the guy's penis, looking for the guy's penis. But her liberal isk thing in her, you know, made it so that she felt bad for him. And she felt like she was objectifying him. So she let him touch her vagina. This is all in public up on a stage, mind you. I mean, this is just demented. When these skanks say they are the most offensive, believe me. But the thing that I took away from it, obviously, is that liberals will share their genitalia if they think it's like an accommodation or an equality issue. If it's a fair exchange of genitalia petting, liberals are down with it. And that's kind of like the takeaway, but... You know, the other thing is that skanks are really living up to their nom de plure.